What's up, guys? These are some paleo bars I ended up finding today at Costco. And if you're not shopping at Costco, what are you thinking? Uh, even if you're just a solo person, you should probably be shopping at Costco simply because of great savings, great deals, the entry fee's not that much, you're always going to use toilet paper, right? You're not going to have too much toilet paper, right? <laughs> paper towels? Soap? Yeah, you should have those things on hand at all times, right? Shop at Costco. Anyways, I don't work for Costco or anything. Um, these are pretty freaking amazing. So they're certified paleo, non-GMO verified, brownie bar. They have a brownie and a coconut chocolate chip or something, and then a coat, and then this one, the maple pecan. So I get it, they're only two ounces. There's two cookies in here. I guess the first thing is typically these are like 30 bucks, 28 bucks, something like that on Amazon. I'll have an affiliate link in the description if you guys want to buy and help support this channel. But whatever, I don't care if you don't. Somebody will. Maybe. <laughs> Anyways, um, I want to mean's grace, I guess. Serves as a symbol for the restoration and harmony and balance between humanity and nature. Healthy fats. So that's true, it's not really keto. This one is the closest kind of keto bar, which, you know, there's like 10 carbs in just one of these. So I could, you know, maybe have one of these on the go if I want to. Let's see, <clears throat> did I say 10 carbs? 15 carbs. Well. It's like seven carbs in two cookies. So the net carbs, if you're counting keto carbs stuff, it's 15 and then you cut it in half if you only have one. So it'd be like seven and a half. Anyways, pretty good ingredients. Make sure it says sea salt. Heck yeah, man. <clears throat> Watch out, could contain shell bits. Save the bees. If we really wanted to save the bees, we just gotta make sure it says non-GMO verified. Or maybe you don't believe that stuff either. Uh, reminds me of an interesting story. There was this, um, some 100%, uh, some kind of, what was it, a bar that was all 100% GMOs. A bunch of people got sick off of them, stomach aches, gut pains, and then they had to take it off the market. That's funny. And then the other funny thing is, you know, if GMOs were so good for you, wouldn't you want them labeled? But everywhere, everybody's all about not labeling GMOs and such. But anyways, these taste awesome. I definitely prefer the maple pecan one. The brownie one is still really good. Um, so I'll open this up and show you what it's like. But look at that, 21 grams of fat. I love that, man. Almond flour, maple syrup... You know, probably don't eat tons of these just because people, if they eat too many of these almond flour products, then they could become sensitive to them. But these, this one carb count is not as satisfying, I think, is what I could say. A um, little bit higher on the carbs. A little bit higher on the added sugars. And again, almond flour. So I was really surprised that these actually have some pretty decent moisture in them. Like, check this out. I'll crack into it now. But anyways, it's two cookies. That's like a one ounce cookie. And that's some nice glistening and stuff, huh? Delicious. All right, so there's some walnuts in there. Probably not great because they all have nut products. If you're allergic to nuts, this isn't for you. But okay, and then we got. They're so delicious, man. And there's just this nice moisture. I mean, they're a little bit sticky. I get it. They made with maple syrup and honey and stuff, right? But it's like 
real food, real bars, man, like real yumminess. They're really good. These would definitely be my go-to bar. I definitely suggest you guys look into these, get these. Looks like chunks and flakes of coconut in there. Cocoa powder, coconut oil, cacao nibs, almond flour. Gosh, man, these guys are so freaking amazing. Let's see. It's gotta just be a walnut, I guess. I mean, it looks like... It looks like coconut, man. But it's not listed as just straight coconut. Too close. Anyways, guys, this is probably my favorite go-to on-the-go bar now. I've literally not tasted anything better than these. The cacao nib is a little crunchy. But this maple pecan, definitely my favorite, guys. Anyways, stay healthy. And uh, like I said, if you want to, I'm, I've been, I started doing the affiliate link thing again. If you want to look through my videos, help support this channel, buy some stuff that I like. Check it out too. Like, share, subscribe. Thanks so much guys. Stay healthy. Check out a couple of these other videos. Check out some of these playlists on my channel too. Thanks.